Hello everyone, this is your homeboy once again, Larry Ayla of the Art and Proud African LGBTI YouTube channel. I'm here at the Regents Park. The weather is nice, not sunny, but it's lovely. I'm here with a guest, Samuel. Do you want to tell my viewers your names? My name is Oluk Ben Gabriel in some way. I'm a gay man from Nigeria. Well, living you. in Cardiff here in the United Kingdom. Thank you, Samuel, for coming to this channel. You're welcome. As a gay man from Nigeria, what's your experience like back home in Nigeria? As a gay man in Nigeria, we face a lot of persecution, beating, and disgrace, a lot of horrible things due to LGBT people like me and from family, community, everyone from the government getting beaten, picked up, unnecessary thing, being refused by everyone and getting beaten up every day and then, especially if you are feminine, like very obvious for people, you get abused a lot, which you can't do anything about. So it's very, very, very hard for people. And for me personally, my dad was a bishop of Anglican, so saw him standing on people, people preaching to a lot of people, especially when they bring us about homosexual, like gay people, they are going to have fire. Like I was very, very up down, deep down, like seeing someone that I can, I supposed to tell about how I'm feeling, still preaching against me, I'm going to have fire. It's very devastating and you know i can see break. i can see you are emotional about that yeah. but here you are in the united kingdom you live in cardiff yes what's your experience like how have you been living your life yeah you know in united kingdom where you can be whatever you want to be enjoy your life nobody cares so i've been very open been to a lot of parties all of that so i'm very happy to be here in the United Kingdom, you are open, you are not in the closet like you are in Nigeria. Yes. Now, the coronavirus pandemic, there was this lockdown, it's eased now. There are challenges during those periods. How did you get through it? Yeah, we faced a lot of challenge during the coronavirus, thanks to OPA at Amparad Africa. They set up a virtual meeting where we hang out sometimes to talk about your feeling and support us with financial like money and voucher to support you and you talk about your feeling just not to be kind of like secluded stuff like that so thanks to Opa for that thank you very much Samuel as a gay man from Nigeria we have followers and subscribers on this YouTube channel all over the world I know you have a message or two for gay men and LGBT community back home. Can you look at the camera and say your message in your local language? Yeah, my people, you know, Nigeria, you have to kind of like, you can't be open, only while open. You have to be like, be careful. Don't go out like that, Loma Arigbubu, anybody like, many people there are just predator looking for people to kill, exhort, and even the police. So any lati farabale and be careful. Yeah, my message for the homophobe like my dad, I just hope you realize what you're doing because being gay doesn't mean you are kind of devil or what. We are created, we are equal. We can live happily among each other. So as you see me now, I'm very healthy, I'm okay. I'm even fine. So I hope you learn what you're doing and change your way. Thank you very much, Samuel. It's nice having you on this program. Thank Hopefully, you. we'll have you some other time. Thank you so much.